We are the Pup Patrol from Brandon Elementary. The animal we've chosen to research is the shelter dog. The problem we've identified is overpopulation of dogs in shelters. According to the ASCPA, 3.9 million dogs enter the 13,600 shelters every year, and 1.2 million of those dogs are euthanized each year. That's one dog every 13 seconds. Yeah, that puts us shelter dogs in a real pickle. Did you say pickle? Maybe I can help. But you'll have to keep watching to find out our solution. I hate Thursdays. What? Thursdays are my days to take care of the dogs we no longer have room for. What do you mean we don't have room? Last time I looked, there were 300 dogs back there when they all had a bed. Well, we get new dogs every single day. We have to get rid of some to make room for the new ones. It's the only way we can accept all of the animals that are brought in. That sounds a little harsh. How do you get rid of them? Look, I know you just started working here, but didn't they explain to you how this place works when you signed up for the job? Explain what? This is a kill shelter. Nobody likes to hear that, but the reality is there's too many dogs, not enough people willing to adopt. The dogs that aren't adopted within a few weeks are euthanized. That means they're killed, by the way. Aw, oh, that's so sad. If only people would get a clue that when it comes to spaying and neutering your pets, we wouldn't have to deal with the problem of overpopulation of dogs in shelters. Did you know that one point that one unaltered dog and her offspring can produce 67,000 dogs in just six years. Wow, that's a lot of dogs. Why don't more people just spay and neuter since overpopulation is such a big problem? Many people think the procedure is too expensive, but according to PETA, it's actually cheaper to spay or neuter than it is to spend millions of taxpayer dollars to round up strays, feed and house them, run adoption campaigns, or euthanize the ones that aren't adopted. Uh oh, the schedule says my day is Friday. Oh, I feel so bad for you. Hate to break it to you, kid, but your day's next Wednesday. What? I can never do that! Well, if you want to keep your job, you'll have to check your turn like the rest of us. I love to grab some lunch and we'll clean the panels when we get back. Hey, bro, did you hear that? I think you're next. You've been here the longest. Oh, Penny, what do I do? Maybe someone will adopt me before it's too late. Well, aren't you like seven? That's 49 human years. Nobody adopts old dogs. You've lived a good life. Let's all the fuss about. I heard it was just like going to sleep. Everyone gathers around you, makes a big fuss, and lights out. That's enough, Gus. We don't need to hear the details. You'll get everyone upset. Thank you, Bowser. Please, everyone, I'm really in a pickle. Come on, everyone, follow me. We'll think of something. The shopping over with. We're having hamburgers for supper. Is there anything special you want to go with them? We need pickles. We need pickles. Okay, I heard you. Here they are. Hmm, kosher dill, sweets, gherkins. What is this? I'm in a pickle pickles. Hey, could you help me fill it out? Look, Gabe, this poor pup looks scared to death. I've never seen a dog on a jar of pickles before. If you're still reading this label, please help reduce the dog population in your area by buying a jar of I'm in a pickle pickles. Pickles with a purpose for only six fifty per pint. What a great idea! <laughs> Do you like pickles? I like pickles. Do you like puppies? I like puppies. So now we have something in common. For every jar of I'm in pickle pickles that you buy, you get a picky puppy point. Pickle puppy point. <laughs> but if you're redeeming for five dollars off for your next bay. for twenty dollars off your next bay or neuter procedure at the Big Fix Clinic. Ready. Okay. Da, da, da. Just let us do it. Just let us do it. Ta-da!